Let's do this. Welcome to another episode of Franchise Friday. We're at Wawa today. Uh, the Turkey Gobbler is back. It's Turkey Gobbler season. The Phillies are in the World Series, taking down H-Town. Houston Astros is going to be a tough one, but I feel like the Phillies got that, that mojo, that swag, man. And um, around this time, the Delaware Valley and Wawa likes to, you know, um, go ahead and bring back the Turkey Gobbler, which is a very popular sandwich here. Um, I've had it when it first came out, and, you know, I, I thought it was pretty good. But now they got new renditions. So instead of a turkey gobbler, you can do a turkey gobbler instead of stuffing, because everybody don't like everybody stuffing. Um, they do here, um, you know, the turkey gravy and sweet potatoes. I haven't had that yet. So let's do this. We're gonna get right into it. You can also get cornbread. And I got me a Red Bull just cause. All right, so let's do this. Shabam. I ain't getting no napkins either, so this is gonna be a hot mess. Oh my god, I made a mistake. That goes to show you I haven't ate this in a while. I've been doing like a lot of small business joints, but you know, Franchise Friday is healthy. So the turkey gobbler, I don't know which one this is right here. I think this might be the sweet potato one. Let's do the sweet potato one. Oh, that is messy, messy globiness. Smells smells good. I ain't gonna front. It smells good. So I got this on a wheat roll. I ain't got no napkins. This is about to be a fumble. Uh, yeah, this is the one with the sweet potato. Turkey gobbler, sweet potato, Wawa. My prediction for the World Series, I got Phillies in seven. This is the sweet potato turkey gobbler, and it's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. Um, the hoagies itself, I don't know what happened to y'all, Wow, Wow, but y'all hoagies used to be the bomb. I remember when y'all was in the hood. And the moment y'all uh, took y'all stores out the hood, um, I think that was probably the moment y'all Wow Wow's was, I mean, I think that was the moment your, your hoagies kind of became whack. I don't know. I shouldn't say whack, it didn't become what it used to be. But this turkey gobbler is worth it. Mm, mm, mm. I didn't expect this to swing like that. This is good, man. Also keep in mind, Wild Wise is either hit or miss, so it all depends on the, the location. This location is pretty good. I'm, I'm heading up the turnpike. Um, and I'm in Jersey, and there's one right here on the Black Horse Pike, which is, they did they did this pretty good. Oh, I like that garlic. Nice garlic in there. Mmm. I mean, it's good, like, relatively speaking, it's good. You know, like, it ain't, if you put this up against other places that does it homemade, it's not going to be as good. But for Franchise Friday, this sandwich right here, the sweet potato one. The sweet potato turkey gobbler, I give this uh I give this one a solid 7.9 out of 10. Mm. Only thing I would need though, the only thing that's missing is like a uh some sort of like crunch to it, you know, some sort of I love the crunch. And, oh man, this garlic aioli is is swinging in this in this sandwich, you know, this is banging. All right, I, I just had to check my footage to make sure it was recording. Um, I'm in a parking lot of Wawa, and uh, I am shooting this in, I don't know why, I normally shoot my videos in 30 or 60 frames per second, but it's shooting in 24, if you guys are wondering why it's more choppier than other, vi other videos. Um, cornbread, that's something you don't uh, associate Wawa with, cornbread. Good healthy cornbread. I don't know. Did they buy this from BJ's or something? It looked like BJ's cornbread. It's good. <laughs> Some of y'all commented on one of my videos, like, yo, what happened to your watch? Yo, sometimes, like Apple Watches, look, can y'all see? So anybody that want to create content, because uh right now I'm I'm shooting 
with the with the rear cameras on the iPhone, right? So, you know, I'm not able to see what I'm recording or even double check it's still recording. So what I use is I use my Apple Watch. I use my Apple Watch just to, to double check. And I'm sorry, it's such a habit because I'm so paranoid. I, I, I'm like wondering, yo, is my thing recording at all? So um, I don't know how they're going to do it. I don't know. Uh, well, yeah. So y'all want to create content? You got Apple Watches. You got an iPhone. Right there, bang. Cornbread solid. This is good. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to crumble some of that cornbread on that turkey gobbler. Let's do it. Up next is the traditional Wawa turkey gobbler. This is the one that um they bring back every year. This is the classic OG turkey gobbler sandwich of Wawa. You know what? If only Wawa offered like indoor seating, that would be lit. That would be super lit. Uh, classic um, this one is clean I don't know about this one this one this one is super clean all right here we go uh, wheat roll got the cranberry turkey gravy um, we're gonna get right into it Thanksgiving around the corner. Mm. That's a little bit on the dry side. I, I need more gravy. I don't know because I, maybe I was sitting in my car. But you know, the first sandwich, I had gravy all over the top. I need more of that. This is lacking in the gravy. But flavor-wise, it's what I remember it used to be. This is, this is delicious. This is what y'all gotta do. Get the uh, get the cornbread. I'm gonna get the cornbread from here, and I'm just gonna crumble that on top. Bang, 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 just like that. Bang, bang. Oh yeah, Phillies and six, by the way. Bryce Harper gonna hit like four home runs in this series. Here we go. This, this is that fat boy ish right here. Here we go. You gotta crumble some of that cornbread in here, the turkey gobbler, and we're gonna take it to work. We're gonna go to work with this one. Fire. Mmm. Mmm. Y'all, y'all, I just created, I just created a monster with this one. Get the traditional turkey gobbler, get the cornbread, and crumble some of that cornbread on this sandwich, and that hits you with that nice, light cornbread sweetness. They got the tart from the cranberry. They got the uh, turkey gravy. And ask for more gravy, though. This needs more gravy. This sandwich is a monster. This right here, straight up Thanksgiving in a roll. That cornbread put this sandwich over the top. I'm gonna give the turkey gobble by itself. I give that because it needs more extra gravy. I give that like a seven, like a seven. If it had extra gravy, probably give it like 7.5. The sweet potato one's better. I don't know. I like that sweetness, but if you put if you put crumble some of that cornbread into the turkey gobbler, that brings it up to for Franchise Friday, that, that brings it up to an eight. You know what I mean? That brings it up to an eight. Y'all gotta try that out. Mm -mm -mm. That is a lot of food. Two sandwiches in the morning. Nowadays, I come to Wawa for, I mean, their breakfast sandwiches are low key hitting, like their Sizzlies. Yo, their Sizzlies went from here to here in the matter of years. Yeah, with that being said, I'm out of here. The turkey gobbler. It'll get you right. It'll get you right. So, go Phils. Fly Eagles fly. Uh, Sixers. 
and Flyers. I mean, it's a great time to be a Philadelphia fan here, Philadelphia sports fan. I love it, man. It's like everyone's nice. Everyone's uh, talking to you when you wear eat like this right here, Phillies. This is one of my favorite logos of all or uniforms of all time. This one, the Eagles, Kelly Green. Um, great. Like whoever was in charge of the uniforms back then just nailed it for Philadelphia. With that being said, I'm out of here. Make sure you subscribe. I'll see you in the next Franchise Friday. Um, yeah. Peace.